Hello everyone, welcome to Static GKIC quiz number 196. This video is aimed to help you with your state and central government exams like SSC, UPSC, state PSCs and banking and insurance related examinations like RRB, IBPS, etc. I'm with Trisha from GK today and I'll be taking you through this. The Bill of Rights and Judicial Review are borrowed from which of the following countries constitution? The correct answer is USA. In the United States, the United States Bill of Rights comprises the first 10 amendments to the United States Constitution. And the Judicial Review is a process under which executive or legislative actions are subject to review by the judiciary. Same is applicable to India. Civil cases, criminal cases and constitutional cases come under which of the following jurisdiction? Correct answer is appellate jurisdiction. Supreme Court is the highest court of appeal and the writs and decrees of Supreme Court run throughout the country. The cases come to the Supreme Court in the form of appeals against the judgments of the lower courts and this is called appellate jurisdiction. Appellate jurisdiction involves the constitution, civil and criminal matters. Which among the following committees is related to backward classes? The correct answer is Kaka Kalilkar Commission. In 1953, the central government established a backwards classes commission under Kalelka's chairmanship with the charter to recommend reforms for removing inequities for underprivileged people. The commission issued its report in 1955 recommending, among other things, that the government grant special privileges to untouchables and other underprivileged people. Reservation of seats for scheduled tribes of Nagaland, Meghalaya, Mizoram and Arunachal Pradesh in Lok Sabha was a broad subject of which of the following amendment acts? Correct answer is 57th Amendment Act. The 57th Amendment Act amended Article 332 in 1987 to provide reservation to scheduled tribes in Nagaland, Meghalaya, Mizoram and Arunachal Pradesh legislative assemblies. Who among the following is related to servants of Indian society? The correct answer is Gopal Krishna Gokhale. Servants of India Society was founded in 1915 by Gopal Krishna Gokhale to build a dedicated group of people for social service and reforms in the field of famine relief, union organization, cooperatives and upliftment of tribals and depressed. The society did commendable work. Dr. T. N. Nair is related to which of the following? The correct answer is Justice Party. The Justice Party, officially the South Indian Liberation Federation, was a political party in the Madras Presidency of British India. It was established in on November 20, 1960 in Victoria Memorial Hall in Madras by T. M. Nair and P. Chetty as a result of a series of non-Brahmin conferences and meetings in the Presidency. Communal division between Brahmins and non-Brahmins began in the presidency during the late 19th and early 20th century, mainly due to caste prejudices and disproportionate Brahminical representation in government jobs. The Justice Party's foundation marked the culmination of several efforts to establish an organization to represent the non-Brahmins in Madras and is seen as the start of the Dravidian movement. With which of the following countries, National People's Congress is related? The correct answer is China. The National People's Congress is the national legislature of the People's Republic of China with 2,980 members in 2018. It is the largest parliamentary body in the world. Arrange Himachal Pradesh, Manipur, Kerala, Maharashtra in correct chronological order of creation. The correct answer is Kerala, which was created in 1956, followed by Maharashtra, created in 1960, Himachal Pradesh created in 1970 and finally Manipur in 1971. In which year Andhra Pradesh was created? The correct answer is 1956. The Congress in its Jaipur session appointed a three-member committee also popularly known as JVP committee after the name of its leaders Jawaharlal Nehru, Vallabhai Patel and Pattabhai Sitaramaya. The committee rejected language as the base of reorganization of states. Srida Mulu, one of the activists demanding the formation of Telugu majority state, died on 16 December 1952 after undertaking a fast unto death. This resulted in the creation of the first state on linguistic basis for Telugu speaking people called Andhra state on October 1st, 1953. It was later reorganized as Andhra Pradesh in 1956. The success of Vardoli Satyagraha gave rise to which one of the greatest leaders of the independence struggle? The correct answer is Sardar Patel. 
The momentum from the Bardoli victory aided in the resurrection of the freedom struggle nationwide. In 1930, the Congress would declare Indian independence and the Sol Satyagraha would be launched by Mahatma Gandhi. It was after Bardoli that Sardar Patel became one of India's most important leaders. With all the controversy around the Statue of Unity, this question is quite relevant in the current UPSC, PSCs and SSC examinations. That's all for today's quiz. Until the next video, goodbye.